sir. Your coffee. 173.5 degree Fahrenheit. Brewed to perfection. And today's newspaper just delivered. Grognak the Barbarian in the Jungle of the Bat Babies. My favorite. Codsworth. Enjoy your coffee, sir. at first, but Codsworth's really good with Sean. Looking in on next week's forecast, we have a high of 52 on Monday. Hun. Wow, look at you. How'd a girl like me ever get so lucky, huh? Nervous? Don't be. Everyone's gonna love the speech. Can you get that? It's probably that salesman. He comes for you every day. Good morning! vault calling! Whatever you're selling, I'm not buying. Oh, no worry, sir. No worries at all. I'm not selling anything. Not today. You can't begin to know how happy I am to finally speak with you. I've been trying for days. It's a matter of utmost urgency, I assure you. Maybe I don't want to talk to you. No. Oh. <clears throat> you do. Now, I know you're a busy fellow, so I won't take up much of your time. Time being a... Uh, mm -hmm. Precious commodity. I'm here today to tell you that because of your family service to our country, you have been pre-selected for entrance into the local vault. Vault 111. Go away. Won't take but a moment. We do need to verify some information to make sure you're cleared for entrance in the unforeseen event of <clears throat> total atomic annihilation. Come back some other time. Come on, hon. It's just a little paperwork. Let him fill it out, and it's done. Come on. You really think it could happen? Nuclear war? Of course not, but look, we have Sean to think of now. Come on, it's not like anything's gonna happen. I know, but it's like insurance. Just in case. For Sean, you know? Yes, right! Just like insurance! So let's get to it. Wonderful. That's everything. Uh, just gonna walk this over to the vault. Congratulations on being prepared for the future. Um, thanks again. Hey, it's peace of mind. That's worth a little paperwork, right? For you and Sean, no price is too high. <laughs> Good answer. I have my moments. <laughs> 